Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get the Blink Streams application to your Fire Stick or Android TV. It's an amazing application that people use to watch live TV online from all over the world. And they got thousands of channels in here, from US, UK, Canada, Australia, and other countries as well. So now, without any further ado, let me show you how to set up and download Blink Streams to your device. First of all, you'll have to get an app called Unloader. You can actually get it totally for free from your official Amazon App Store. To do so, we'll have to go to search on your device. And there, in the search bar, you'll need to start typing Downloader. And from the bottom, we'll click on Downloader application. And basically, here's the app that you need to get to your device. But after you get Downloader, it is not over yet. We still need to set it up. So in order to actually set up Downloader, we'll have to go to the settings on your device. Here they are. Click on that button with the gear icon, scroll down and then go to My Fire TV. Let's open it. And here you'll have to turn on the developer options on your device. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Stick devices, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case and you cannot find developer options anywhere, no need to worry, it's actually easy to make them appear. Just go to About, select Fire TV Stick, and now you'll have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times. And do it fast. So let's do it. And as you can see, now at the bottom for me it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. So if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options, which have appeared for us right here. So let's open them, make sure to turn on the ADB debugging, then go to install known apps, and from here you'll have to find the loader and turn that option on. So what it does, it's going to allow you to install other application from the internet and not necessarily only those apps, which are only available in the official Amazon App Store. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now, finally, We'll have to go to the list of apps on your device. Let's do it. There it is. We open the list. And there you'll find the loader, which is set up and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the loader, there's one more thing which I always recommend doing. It's, of course, connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN because they're super fast. We got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use, and they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is great pricing for us, the users. In a VPN app, you just connect to any server, let's say I will connect to Romania right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means no one can track you or snoop on you online, and that's really important if you want to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in the pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN with 3 months for free. Or just scan the QR code, which you can see on the screen right now, with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now, finally, let's use Downloader safely. So we go to the list of apps on your device, open the Downloader application from here. Then here on the left side menu, it's very important that you click on Home and not on Browser. So once again, make sure that you have clicked on Home, and then in that search bar, we'll need to enter a code, which is going to be blinkstreams.com. So yeah, not a code, a link, but yeah, blinkstreams.com. Let's enter it together. So here we go, you can see the link on your screen right now, make sure to enter it exactly as you see and do not make any mistakes, because obviously if you make a mistake, then the link is not going to work. After that you'll have to click on go 
and while the website is loading, make sure to subscribe my channel so you would get even more content about flower sticks, as well as please hit the like button below this video. It really helps me a lot and this way I'll be able to create even more videos for you. And now after the website has opened, we just have to scroll it down a little bit until you find that download Blink Streams APK button. That's exactly what we're looking for, so we click on download, and in a couple of moments the download is going to start. Usually it doesn't take long, but of course it all depends on the connection speed on your device. Then you have to click on install and wait until Blink Streams gets installed to your Fire Stick or Android TV device. And then, after it's installed, don't click on open yet, instead press on done, because this way we'll have an option to delete the installation files, as we don't need them anymore on your device. So click on delete, and then delete once again. This way we'll get rid of unnecessary files from your Fire Stick and save yourself some free space on your device. And that's really important, because you don't have too much of free space on your device anyway. Then finally, let's go to the list of apps on your Fire TV, which is right here, let's open it, and there's the Blink Streams, which we just unloaded. Now, I would recommend you to click on the Options button on your remote, that's the button with three horizontal lines. Click on it, and then press on Move to Front. This way, Blink Streams is always going to be at the very top of your application list, and therefore, it's going to be super easy for you to access the app every time needed. Just don't forget to keep the VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble. Enjoy and see you next time. Bye bye.